Corrugated Cardboard While this little wasp likes corrugated cardboard for the hiding places it provides, we use it mainly to pack our goods, move house, or build display stands and retail-ready packaging, as well as creating furniture. Corrugated cardboard has two key qualities. It is light and strong. What makes it light and strong? Its structure. Two flat sheets, the liner boards, envelop a corrugated sheet. The larger the corrugations, the stiffer the cardboard will be. Thick corrugated cardboard is ideal for absorbing impacts and withstanding vertical compression. The corrugations can also be small. The thinner the cardboard, the easier it is to print on its liner boards, and the more resistant it will be to crushing and flat compression. We can also use a single corrugated sheet to secure or protect products. The layers can be piled up one, two, three, four, and the more there are, the stronger the cardboard will be. Okay, but how are these corrugated sheets made? We take rolls of paper, which can be either recycled or craft paper. We then feed them through this corrugating machine. It uses heat, moisture, and pressure to corrugate the paper. This is a highly technical process. We then apply starch to the peaks to stick the components together before placing the liner board on top to provide the corrugated cardboard with cohesion and strength. Now that we have produced large sheets of corrugated cardboard, they need to be processed. First, they go through printing machines. Next, they pass through cutting machines, then folding machines. Sometimes, printing, cutting, and folding are combined. To sum up, corrugated cardboard is made from liner boards and corrugated layers that can vary in height and number, using quite complex manufacturing and processing methods to maximize strength. To find out more about corrugated cardboard, contact us.